This module is about using a standard problem solving process to get better at solving problems so they don't come back again. Try to think of a time when you had a problem. You did some digging into what was causing the problem, fixed that, and were able to keep moving forward. How'd that make you feel? I know that when I do that, I feel great. When I actually fix something, I get this feeling of victory. I have a tractor to cut our grass at home. It takes me about four hours to cut the grass. Tractors are notorious for breaking down just when you need them the most. When my tractor breaks down, and if I have to send it to the shop for repair, the grass doesn't care. It just keeps growing. Sometimes I have to wait two weeks for my repaired tractor. By the time it gets back, it takes two or three mowings to get things back under control. That's a day to a day and a half of mowing. Sometimes, because I don't want to be without my tractor, I'll dig into the tractor problem to diagnose it and fix it. When I really dig, find the root cause of the problem and fix it, it makes me feel amazing. Sometimes between fist pumps of victory, I do a little end zone dance. Fixing the problem, fixing the thing that's getting in the way of forward progress just makes you feel better. Now, take that idea into the workplace. Problems can be really frustrating, right? I especially hate the kinds of problems that happen frequently, as if we didn't have the exact same thing happen just a day ago. This module is an introduction to a simple problem solving process for you to use when you hit a problem at work. Like me and my tractor, you and your team face problems every day that get in the way of forward progress. Fixing these problems by yourselves will feel good. In fact, it will also prevent the headaches that come from unfixed problems, like having to work around the problem, adding time and maybe extra steps. You know, the things that frustrate us at work. So, in a way, problems are good for us. Because if we can find them and fix them, life is better. We like to say problems are blessings or gifts. Let's get started by getting a good definition for a problem.